being a role model to the younger people in Christ the King, because everyone is so happy for me. Now that the winner comes from Christ the King, I'll expect more people in the school to also take the initiative and take part in more programs like the Literacy Challenge, because it really helps the younger generation to unearth their talents. If I didn't do this, I wouldn't have known that I had the potential in me to win something like this. So this is just an encouragement to anyone out there who wants to try something new. You should go for it. You might win. I mean, we're all so happy for her because we all cheered her on and we all inspired her to take part in it because we knew she was capable. So when she won, it was like a victory for the whole class because it was as if we had all won since we are all one. So it was really a really thrilling and exciting experience for us. I wasn't surprised when I found out about her winning the literacy challenge because she seems a smart student. She tops us all in English. Compositions are perfect. She doesn't, she doesn't make mistakes when she's talking. And apart from that, she's perfect, they're academic, everything. Even if you check the mock right now, she was like first too. She still is quite good in social studies and other subjects. You know, she's overall students, you can see one of the best in, in, the, in her class. You know, she has, Provide knowledge of things, of, uh, foreign affairs, current affairs, and those things, all those things. And social studies, I think, is one of the best, if not the best, in the class. 97.3 City FM, Relevant Radio, always.